we have some data in here from Stripe. We used the coefficient add-on to bring this in. If you do not have coefficient, go to extensions, add-ons, get add-ons, and then search for coefficient in the add-on store. And then when you install it, you can connect it to various data sources and bring that data straight into Google Sheets. So we're going to use this data and quickly manipulate it to get a quick report. We have these amounts in different currencies. And so we want to be able to convert this to USD. And then we'll create a quick table at the end to figure out our total sales, total shipping, discounts, merchant fees, and then our net. And so we're going to go ahead and open the coefficient add-on. And we're going to use a new feature called the Formula Builder to help us populate these amounts. All right, so let's go ahead and convert these amounts. So if D3 USD converge E3 to USD using D3 as the base currency. And then we'll go ahead and we'll copy this formula. Paste that in. And there's our result. We'll go ahead and copy this down. And then let's go ahead and just quickly modify this. Since we're doing the same thing for each of these, let's go ahead and just lock our D3 using a dollar sign and that'll prevent it from moving when we drag this over. And we want both of these to drag over, but not the D3. So we'll just go ahead and do that. And now as you watch, as we drag this over, these will change to F and these will stay at D. So let's go ahead and drag that over. And there we have it. And now we can take these and drag these down as well. And now we have everything converted to USD. We can go ahead and use a very simple formula here. And just add up our I column. We can add J column. Or Fyro R L column. And then to get our total, those two, 03 plus 04 minus our discounts and minus our merchant fees. Then we can just add some currency formatting here. Get rid of maybe our decimal places for some, some simple streamlined numbers. Now we can see our total sales, total shipping, discounts, merchant fees, and then our net total. 